the human body is almost completely covered in hair. While thick hair on the head is considered attractive, hair in other areas is often a nuisance, especially for women. Laser hair removal offers a popular and relatively low pain solution. Let's take a closer look at how focused light affects hair growth. Hair develops in the hair follicles. These small organs go through a recurring cycle consisting of the growth, transition, and resting phases. Hair is formed during the growth phase. Matrix cells divide particularly quickly at this stage and produce numerous daughter cells. At the same time, melanocytes produce pigments, which they pass on to the upward migrating cells. In the transition phase, the follicle shortens and hair formation stops. In the resting phase, which can last several months, the hair gradually loosens and can be removed painlessly, or it is replaced by new, growing hair. The laser treatment now works as follows. The light energy generated by the laser device is absorbed by the pigments in the hair and transferred to the surrounding cells in the form of heat. The heating impairs growth and the hair falls out after one to two weeks. Several sessions are usually necessary to achieve a satisfactory result. This is because not all hair follicles are in the growth phase at the same time and are therefore firmly attached to the hair they contain. The heat energy is transferred less effectively. If there is no hair in the follicle at all, the effect of the laser is lost. If you want to learn more about how the body works, don't forget to subscribe. And if you found the video helpful, feel free to leave a like.